What's up YouTube? How we doing? Thanks for checking out another video. This one's going to be a series of videos on the Lowrance Elite 4 HDI. So I want to show you guys real quick what I run my Lowrance on. This is a small 12 volt 5 amp hour lead acid core battery. Um, this is plenty of power for the Lowrance. I've ran this all weekend and not run out of battery yet. So this has been a great battery. I believe it's a rechargeable battery that they manufacture for small automotive or alarm applications. You can pick these up at Interstate Batteries for, you know, I don't know, fairly cheap, 40, 50 bucks. This is the dry box that I use for the Lowrance, um, or actually for the battery. I picked this dry box up at Walmart for less than $10. I drilled out a hole in the side and then used an old tire rubber for a grommet to keep water from getting inside. I used Velcro on the battery and on the inside of the dry box to ensure that the battery doesn't slip around or move around while it's in, in there. To recharge the battery, and I hear that this is a really important part of you know maintaining your battery is having a smart charger. Something that recognizes when the battery is full, it will automatically cut off and stop charging. Uh, this is for safety reasons and also it will keep your batteries lasting longer. But this is a speed charger uh, for small automotive um, or you know security batteries that sort of thing so this has really worked out well but it's got the auto voltage detection to where once it gets once the battery gets full this will cut off and that's how I run my Lowrance Elite 4 HDI when I'm out on the water thanks for checking out one of my Lowrance Elite 4 HDI tips let me know if you have any questions or comments I hope this helps out